This is my father-in-law's place. It's really cool. They've uh, got about five and a half, six acres here. They put this shop on it and you can see all the little different areas they've done. This is an actual well and they just built that little thing over it to look cool. But uh, it's gonna supply the shop the greenhouse and both of the houses and another shop over here that they're putting on it. And they're basically gonna have two of the families live here. Uh, my wife's sister is gonna build here, her and her husband. And this is the shop that they built. Love the color of it. Got him a wannabe North Star up here. He ended up buying a Ranger and then added all the accessories to it. Of course, you can't put the air conditioning in one, but you can put the system on it and it'll blow air. It's just not super cold. That was besides the point, but I just want to show you guys this place. I think he did a really good job with the layout. He's got uh, all the way back at the back, you can see there's a fire pit. I'll kind of walk through it and show you guys the whole little place. This is a gardening shed and you know, they've got these, we cut all these beams for them and then they cut them to size and made little beds out of them. Actually, they're pretty big beds, but those are three and a half by sixes turned up right and then jointed at the ends. And then they use railroad ties, pea gravel, and you can see they've got all their stuff. Pea gravel and the concrete. These are railroad ties, but This fence I love too. They ordered this in from somewhere. I can find out if you guys want to know. But they built these columns. Sewed a bunch of fescue. Yard looks good. They use a Spartan mower and then a John Deere lawn tractor to go around through here. But... Uh, Todd, my father-in-law, he's the one down there with my son mowing. He's really good and he's very particular about his stuff. But they've they've got a long ways to go, but they've got a little woodshed over here. And they put a fence, goes all the way back behind the shop and then down to the road on the other side. Played a bunch of laid a bunch of trees out. I'll show you guys the fire pit. I always like to see stuff like this, so it's always nice to see someone's layout, give you some ideas and stuff. Not really doing any of this for, you know, showing out or stuff, just to uh, give people an idea of things to do. They've had some water drainage problems through here. So they're gonna, if they can't get it to quit keeping water there, they're gonna have to end up French draining it either to the road or over to one of the ditches. And that's all of it so far when they get the houses and stuff put in. I think one of the houses is going right in there and then a pool behind it. And then another house right in that area between the two trees and a shop over in this area. There's some really, really nice houses out this way though.